The goose, the goose, the goose is on the loose. A clever goose stops traffic on a zebra crossing. What will these animals ever stop coming up with trouble, will they, guys? This goose on the loose is from the BBC. The clever goose stops traffic on the zebra crossing. And a clever goose has been snapped using a zebra crossing in a busy town centre. The entire town was grinded to the halt by this goose. When all it could just simply do is fly away without having to need to cross the damn road. Don't give me the premise of why did the goose cross the road. I don't have an answer. I'm not that kind. I'm not that smart, guys. You will have to figure out that joke for me. Give me your joke for why the goose crossed the road in the comment section down below. A flock of geese has lived by the River Neen in March, Cambridgeshire, for more than 11 years and can often be found waddling in and out of shops. Out of the shops? A spokesperson for the British Trust of Orthodontology, BTO, said the birds were highly intelligent, but they had never seen geese do this. Hmm. Charlie Bedford, 67, who photographed the safety, uh, the safety conscious bird, said, I thought, oh no, he'll be run over. But as calm as you like, he went to the zebra crossing and stepped out. We could not believe it. He added, I quickly grabbed my camera and snapped away. The vehicle stopped and he just waddled on, oblivious to it all. We were all in fits of laughter. Was it waddling inside a... That's a super drug store. What on earth do geese have to do in a super drug store? They only do health and beauty. They don't even do animal food in there. Mr. Bedford's photographed the goose uh, dubbed Gary holding up traffic at the newly installed zebra crossing on Broad Street. He posted His images posted on social media quickly generated several comments. Some people claimed to have seen the geese using zebra crossings in other parts of the town, while others believed that their droppings could cause hazardous. Well, of course, droppings are hazardous either way. And, uh, and they will get an, uh, an, un, an unnice stain on your boots or shoes, for that matter. That is for sure. There is a well-known goose in the garden of the house uh, by the uh, river in March, who is always honking and spitting at past the bars, said Mr. Bedford. He's very territorial, better than a guard dog. Uh, and locals dub him Gary the Goose. So I gave the goose, uh, gave the goose on the zebra crossing the same name. It suits a goose. Oh, coming out of a bakery as well. Hmm. Very interesting. Others reference the famous Beatles Abbey Road album cover from 1969, where the band was seen walking a zebra crossing. Liverpool had the Beatles. We got the geese, said one person. The BTO spokesperson said they have seen videos of seagulls wandering into shops, but were not aware of geese doing the same. Seagulls. Well, we know what the seagulls are doing going into shops. As for the rows, I expect that they will have just learnt the traffic and generally stop when they walk out. And I can only imagine that the zebra crossing is a coincidence, they added. Perhaps they have discovered that cars are more likely to stop there. I have seen people crossing at that point. Many birds are highly intelligent, with certainly some, such as cows and gulls, are more capable of observing and learning such behaviour. But personally, I've never seen geese do this. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting to say the least, guys. I will say this, though. It is an interesting prospect. If you think about it, if the birds, as many people claim, to be highly intelligent, when you see people crossing a certain point across the road enough times, you, you will probably realise, perhaps, if I do the same thing, I won't get hit. Just a fault in their head. So, tell me in the comments down below, why did the geese cross the road? There has to be a reason behind it. So let me know why down below. But before you head out, let me just say, if you haven't already and you find this video insightful and helpful to you, an understanding of the knowledge of the geese, hit the like button, share across social media, subscribe, and maybe even uh, join my YouTube membership for 99p if you really want to. But thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to catch you all very, very soon.